Of your work. I. Sorry. Big interview. Excuse me, but do you know where I could find Brat's magazine? In the trash? And I like keep mine in a secret drawer, so no one knows I read it. <gasps> you read Brat's magazine? <gasps> like, how did you know? You've been spying on me! Haven't? How? Oh, haven't? Never mind. Haven't? Have there it is. Have Thanks. Have Thanks. Have I'm Prudence, and might I say, oh, I can't find my way around, around here. Oh, so stuff, oh my. Good oh, yeah, that totally looks good. It so matches. <laughs> Where's my new CD? I'm supposed to review it. Which is better for a lunch date? Hot Hot or Basic Hot? Has anyone seen the phone number to that new vegan restaurant? I what can't find anything. Can 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 someone, someone answer, answer the phone? phone? <laughs> Got it. I'll recommend track seven. It's awesome. Brad's magazine, can you hold? Thanks. Brad's magazine, hold please. Thank you. That was amazing. I believe this might be the phone number for the restaurant you're looking for. Go with the black. Simple but stylish. Who are you? I'm Prudence. I'm here about the ad for the office assistant, the job interview. That was your interview. You're hired! Ah, I, I got the job? Oh, this is really neat. Waxing bill, waxing bill, package from Tahiti, waxing bill. Ooh, this one's like a letter from an old boyfriend. Dearest Burdine, how I miss the way the sunlight plays upon the bulging veins in your eyeballs. What's going on here? Uh, Berdine, we were j just... Uh, we were just about to give you the latest fashion report. Seersucker is still out. <coughs> Way out! But Velour is coming back, like, softer and more velour than ever. I already know the fashion news, you twin insects. Tell me what's going on next door. Tell me what the brats are up to. They interviewed a new assistant. Boring. Seems like some farm girl. Maybe she'll milk their chickens. You are like such a bird brain. She can't milk their chickens because they like don't have any. Duh. Hey, what are you a new assistant, eh? Good for the brats. In fact, I think a new assistant is an excellent idea. You mean like you might hire an assistant too? Why would you want uh three assistants? I won't have three assistants. Now go fetch Royale his morning yappuccino, or else! Teen heartthrobs file under T and H, cross-reference with C for cute, W for way cute, and U for ultra-mega-cute-tastic. Personal context file under C, and cross-reference under... Hmm, Prudence? <gasps> oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't know you were there. I'm such a dope. I'll pick these up in a jiffy. Hey, it's okay. I was just gonna say how you really saved us today. You're a class act. And one proficient professional. Oh, thank you, Brett. Uh, ma'ams. Ma'ams? 
Ew. First names only. When you work with the Bratz, you're part of the Bratz family. Sorry, it's just... Well, I'm from a small town, and this is all sort of overwhelming, I guess. I just never know what to expect next. Good news, everyone. The score is about to be Bratz 379, Birdine 0. You got it? Tell us you got it. I got the exclusive! Ah! Oh, that's that's amazing. Amazing. Sasha. You are the best! <laughs> An exclusive what? Um... It's okay, Bunny Boo. You can tell Prudence. She's in the Bratz family. Okay, but before I say anything else, Prudence, you have to swear you won't tell a soul. Girls, I think it's time for the Bratz Oath of Secrecy. Do you, Prudence, solemnly swear to uphold all that is good and trendy in the fashion world, to follow your own fashion sense, and to keep secrets secret? I do. Yes! Evan Moles is leaving his band. Bass is loaded. He's going solo and I'm getting the whole story. Bass is loaded and Evan is out. Evan Moles never gives interviews. Now all we've got to do is keep this secret from you know who. Who's you know who? Burdine. She's the publisher of Your Thing magazine. Which is definitely not our thing. Is she really that bad? Watch it! Observe. Oh! I, like, couldn't hear a thing. Me neither! The door's too thick! It was her idea! Boo! Ah! Ah! They work for Birdine. She'll do anything to learn every secret we have, and even the ones we don't have. I had no idea this business was so... Uh, cutthroat. Oh, you better believe it. But enough about that. Sasha Scoop calls for a celebration. Juice bar! <laughs> Come on, join us. But really, I... wouldn't? Couldn't? Shouldn't? We don't know the meaning of those words. Let's go! The files! Be right there. You better. And lock the door behind you. Oh, I'll lock the door. After all, in this cutthroat business, there's no telling who might worm their way into the precious brat's office. So, I decided to leave my little town and take the chance of my dreams to work for a fashion magazine. Only, I'm afraid in the city I don't always know how to... Uh, hold that thought. H-O-T-D, straight ahead. H-O-T-D. Hunk of the day! Which one of us is new in town? And needs to meet people. Me? Oh, no, I couldn't. I mean, I'm terrible at talking to guys. Not anymore, thanks to modern technology. Bingo! Archaeology. Lucky you, he's got a brain. Try this. Hi! I couldn't help noticing that you're reading an archaeology book. Which do you prefer, Egyptian pyramids or Mayan pyramids? You guys make it sound so easy. All it takes is practice. So, I've got a... A shirt, iced tea, food in my teeth. <gasps> Settle up that. We can't decide, like, which one of us is way hotter. I say it's me, and she says nothing interesting ever. Uh, sorry, girls. I've got to run. Fools! What do you think you're doing? Like, picking up a total hot bucket. Duh! And you call us dodos. Don't you work for Burdine? Surely you know who I am. The lady who axes Birdine's back? Oh, uh, we like got all your bells. Prudence, are these girls giving you a hard time? Oh, shucks, it's okay. No one messes with our girl. Look, there goes that guy. And he's selling discount shoes. Our two favorite things. Get out of my way, I saw first, I totally did. Weevils, gotta love them. 
No, no you don't. don't. Thanks for getting rid of them. So, maybe we should get back to work? Uh, uh, uh. We're not giving up on you that easily. This is our male mannequin. We use him for fashion design. But today, he's Practice Pete, the guy you want to date. You have two minutes to get him to say yes. Go. Uh, happy. See, this is a bad idea. All you need is a little more confidence. And maybe a little less velocity. I don't even understand why you're trying to help me. It's the work that counts, right? Some things are more important than work, Prudence. Like helping a friend. You got it! Good news! The interview is on! Bad news! Evan's manager wants to have the interview here! But if Birdine or the Tweed will see him, there goes our exclusive! We need to keep extra quiet about this. Brett's promise? Promise! Oh, I promise. Of course. Okay, we like promise! And you better keep your promise. I didn't tell you about my plan earlier because neither of you knows how to stay quiet. How come you have that grass skirt? I'm getting ready for Tahiti and my new life of relaxation, which starts tomorrow when I retire from your thing. Ah! Oh, everyone's a dreamer, yeah. Once you have a dream, yeah. You can be a believer, oh. You gotta just believe oh, Come on now Don't be afraid To do what you feel Just know inside Yeah You gotta be you and what you do Listen to your heart You gotta be you and let everyone be who they are What makes you different Is what makes you special To you know what to do To yourself be true Cause you gotta be You gotta be you Yeah, I go on tour next month. Mostly small clubs. How are the other guys in the band reacting? They're cool with it. Great! I think that's all my questions. Prudence, do you have anything? <gasps> Me? Uh... Well, have you decided on a look yet? Well, I guess the same thing I usually wear. What do you think? Well, it's just that... Wouldn't you want to do something a bit different? Like, make a statement. Something that says, I'm the same Evan Moles, but now I'm on my own. Whoa, that's deep. You got a point. Smart girl. To Prudence! Working for you guys has been... I can't tell you how great it's been. I feel so much more confident, and... I asked Evan Moles a question. It'll be in the magazine, with your name. Your... Giving me credit? I don't know what to say. Say, hi, handsome. H-O-T-D is back. Perfect. Now take that Evan Moles attitude and get over there. Hi. I couldn't help but notice the book you're reading. Archaeology. Yeah, it's a little hobby of mine. I'm true. Our little office assistant is all grown up. I had a good feeling about her the moment she walked through our door. Finished! Base is loaded and Evan is out is good to go. We'll proof it tomorrow and slot it in the next issue. Yasmin and I are off to see Evan at his secret recording session. How about you, Prudence? Thanks, but I've just got some things to take care of. Sure, we understand. A girl does like her privacy now and then. Thanks. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Now that was one wicked session. I've got to add some of those hot lyrics to the interview. Hey, look, it's Prudence. What's she doing here so late? A rendezvous with H-O-T-D? At the office? That's kind of weird. 
And where is she going? Hmm. Let's check it out. Ew, the alley? Talk about a cheap date. Look, someone's coming. Good evening, my helpful brat's assistant. It's Bertine. Do you have the disc? It's right here. Excellent. My exclusive interview with Evan Moles, procured by my own little mole. What are they doing? And come tomorrow, the new editor of Your Thing magazine. Hop in, Prudy. My interview! betrayed us! Oh, I can't believe it! I just cannot believe it! I was her friend! She was my friend! Now everyone will think Burdine got the interview instead of us! Base is loaded, Brett's out. Hi, girls. Who wants fresh bagels? I've had such a night, you will not believe it. Not your version of it, we won't. We know you gave the interview to Burdine. No, you've got it all wrong. I... trust me, I know what you must be thinking, but I did the right thing. You did not do the right thing. You're wasting your breath and our time. There's the door. Try to let it hit you on the way out. Guys, I... You're fired! <laughs> what now? Oh, great. Tweedle devious and Tweedle dumb. Look what I've got, Casey. Why, whatever is that, Kirsty? It's the hot off the press new issue of your thing. Oh, I hear there's an exclusive interview with Evan Moles inside. One for you, and one for you, and one for you. Oh, yes. I can't forget about you. Please try. Now get out! Like happy reading! <laughs> oh, that is good! Man, that's good! How can you be laughing? We lost our scoop! Listen to this! Evan wept with joyous pride as he announced that he's having an alien's baby. Say what? I like to fly through space on my glittery fruit bat, says Evan. This isn't my interview with Evan. It's not even a real interview. Oh! What was that? The ghost of the murdered hyena bride. More like Burdine just read her own story. <gasps> Please, you ain't got to hide us. Why should we do that? <sighs> because we need hiding! This means that Prudence didn't set us up. She set up Verdine. And we yelled at her. She's giving up on her dream. We gotta stop her. Chloe, you check the train station. Yes, check the bus depot. Jade, you check the limousine. Oh, uh, hi guys. Prudence. We know you didn't really betray us, but apparently that's about all we know. I was about to tell you everything when I came in the office. You see... There you are, you traitor! Wait till I tell your mother about this! Berdine knows your mom? Berdine is my mom's sister. <gasps> Ew! That means you're... Berdine's niece? You poor, poor girl. Finally, I save enough to retire to Tahiti. Your thing was yours. All you had to do was prove yourself by betraying the brats. Sorry, Aunt Berdeen, but I just couldn't do it. My dear nasty backstabbing little Prudy, how did you go so wrong? The only reason I ever was a backstabber is everyone else in the family is a backstabber. It's all I ever knew. But these guys... They were so cool to me. They made me a part of their family. 
I didn't have to prove myself to them. They just accepted me. Berdine Maxwell, I'm an attorney for Evan Moles. In light of your magazine's false interview, Mr. Moles is suing you for $1.3 million. Oh! My savings! My retirement! Ugh. Come here, you twittering twin nitwits! We've got a magazine to run! What about you, Prudence? You don't have to leave. You could keep working for us. I think I'd like that. Someday. But I just accepted another offer. Hey, girls. Oh, crazy thing. I stopped off for some tacos and ran into your friend Prudence. He wants me to consult on wardrobe for his tour. Prudence, wow, nice. congratulations. congratulations. Right on, girl. Hey, to make up for it, I'll let you guys publish the pictures. A tour exclusive. Deal. We're stuck with Berdine again, and we don't have an assistant. But at least we still have our interview. And a great new friend. And really, what more could we want? <laughs>